okay. Well, thank you everyone for being here in support of our public health, the environment, and creating strong communities where everyone has access to a good job in community and environment safe industries. Reimagine Beaver County began when local residents came together to declare what kinds of sustainable development would support a resilient and equitable community. The mission for RBC remains the same as it was in 2017 with the first visioning workshops. To be guided by climate conscious economic development strategies and to promote workforce development that emphasizes renewable energies and offers a balanced combination of economic, environmental, and social benefits. Systems change when forces disturb the patterns of the past. One way to change a system is to stir it up. That is the role for many of us who are here today. Protest and action. To clearly identify the problems the fossil fuel industry creates for the environment, which trickle down to hurt people, their health, and their safety. If leadership were to work through a greener lens in this region, set goals and objectives for a green economy, the natural evolution of business development in the growing clean energy and non-fossil fuel industries would create the jobs everyone is asking for. This economic stability is a foundation for food access, education, healthcare access, all the benefits of a resilient community. With the generous support of the League of Women Voters and other advocates for a clean economy, RBC has been researching and educating about how to bring green jobs to the area. Our RBC report published in 2018 identified four possible sectors of development. We are in conversations with partners to explore projects in these areas. The Reimagine Job Showcase project is currently offering a series of webinars that demonstrate you do not have to choose between a family sustaining job and a healthy environment. The programs educate about many career opportunities and pathways, including ones into union jobs and careers. This spring, a two-part webinar explained the new developments in the biomaterials industries and new partnerships are being formed in neighboring states through our involvement in Reimagine Appalachia, a four-state coalition working to insert our voices into the national climate change conversations and draw federal investments into this region. Scientists, researchers, ed educators, even religious leaders are telling us to pay attention to how climate change is affecting our lives, our homes, our financial situations, jobs, education opportunities, health, and our environment. Many cities, counties, states, and countries around the world are growing through innovative technologies, reducing carbon emissions, looking for safer alternatives to harmful products such as single-use plastics, and striving for regenerative economies with zero waste cycles. We here in Beaver County want to do that too. Activism to stop the pipelines, cracker plant, and fracking is important and must continue. But to rally support and change minds away from the fossil fuel industry, we need to capture people with positivity rather than giving them something to criticize, like environmentalists kill jobs. We need a new narrative for this region, one that is responding to climate change, favors sustainable and renewable industry jobs, addresses social issues, and more. This is the Reimagine Beaver County Project. Visit our Facebook page, download our report, Join us at our events. Visit the BC Max table right over there for details on how to be in touch with us. Yes, our work may sound difficult. We are looking to change old patterns and paradigms. And this may even sound impossible, but that just means that it's going to take a little longer. I know that we all have this in us, guys. We can do this if we stick together and we care about our planet. It is the only one we have. So happy Earth Day, everyone, and thank you for being here and for your support.